everyone welcome back to my channel today i'm preparing a quick lunch we're making tortellini filled with spinach and uh, cheese normally you can do this by yourself but um yeah i'm going to prepare the ready-made you know that kind of hectic life when you quickly have to just prepare something and eat and continue doing something else so um yeah so as you can see, these are the ingredients that I'm going to use for this menu. I have the tomato and then I have the red paprika. I have the red um, onion. Then I have some garlic. I got a green paprika. It gives really good flavor. So yeah. guys, I got everything ready. Um, over here, I got the tomato that I grated because um, I don't like those tomato. I don't like the tomato skin in my tomato sauce. And then I have the pap red paprika. It's already uh, sliced. The green paprika. And here I got the ginger and the garlic. I grated that too. I don't want to see any pieces in it as well. And over here, I got the onion ready. So let's get started. spices that I'm gonna need. I need the salt, the pepper, and the beef cube actually, but it's in a bowl for fun. And then I got the chili cube and just a special spice from Kenya. Onions look like this. I'm gonna add the green paprika. Then I'm going to add the red paprika as well. Just stir that together. Stir that stuff together. Then let's add the ginger and the garlic. So, the sauce look like right now so what I'm going to do I'm gonna add the spices just for this sauce I'm gonna add just a half of the chili cube then pepper Guys, there are some things that you, jo you don't necessarily need to measure. You know, there are some people that they have to measure everything they are putting in their food. There are some things that you just need to check and think of what could be enough as you cook. Huh? So what next is... I will add one teaspoon of the chibudiro spice over here. Then I will add a half spoon of the beef cube. As I say, it's we get it like this from the supermarket. And that's actually it. You gotta be careful because um, it gets very hot and then it starts burning. That's not really good. Yeah, that's how it looks like so far. Continue stirring. Then let's go on with the tomato. So far, this is how it looks like. You just let it cook, let it cook slowly, slowly, 
and it's gonna be really good i know that some people don't want to have these pieces of um small pieces of uh, paprika and so on so you can it's an option for you or even like for example you can see over here you still can see the onion so if you don't want to have this in your sauce you can just blend the sauce but actually for me i don't find that necessary but i think you could blend it and then you will really get a smooth sauce so as this continue cooking i'm going to prepare the totally clean it's ready got just very little salt in inside and some olive oil eh? so what i'm going to do i'm going to add the tortellini and let them just cook for two to three okay, minutes we've come to the end of this video and if you like how um if you like this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up or just give me a feedback if you have another idea on how to prepare tomato sauce please let me know yeah, so you can just leave your comment on the comments box below. Stay blessed and come again. Bye.